And hello everyone, this is Dr. Jerry Cuomo. Uh, I'm here to talk to you a little bit today about uh, the various applications of the bone level uh, implant and how we can compare it with other systems. This system is a Stroman Select system, uh, similar to that of bone level, not exactly the same, but has similar ideas. So. This is a solid pore, a second solid pore model. I'm going to sh show you the uh, surgeon's peak abutment. And this one happens to be the one that's designed with this particular uh, company. The peak abutment goes in place, and you can see that uh, the model's been modified uh, all the way around the, the abutment. But how did we do that? Well, if you look at the impression, you're going to find that this particular model has the um, the flare to it uh, and around the tissue because we designed that inside of the impression coping. All right, so this is the uh, impression coping. Again, modified uh, before the patient uh, came into the chair and sat down. And uh, if you notice, there's a blue, similar block out material that we used in other cases. And we just uh, modify uh, the next uh, uh, impression coping. So it, we don't necessarily have to be locked into one system. The point I want to make here is that you can, you can actually use this, uh, this idea with, with other systems. This happens to be an open tray technique with uh, Nobel BioCare and their system. Uh, and that uh, is for a central incisor. The, um, getting back to the bone level idea, uh, as it compares now to Strauman's uh, regular uh, solid abutment, as you can see, the solid abutment doesn't really give uh, an opportunity for the dentist to make a crown with margins that are more toward the crest of the tissue, making it almost, uh, well, making it difficult to clean the cement after, uh, after we place the crown. In my other video segment on the cementation of this particular crown, we show you the exact technique and how to do it without entrapping cement below the tissue. So a little drawback here on uh, the relatively ease of use. Certainly they all work the same and work well. You just have to mine your, uh, your technique. Uh, comparing this one now with the bone levels, this one happens to be um, a final impression uh, utilizing the bone level. So these are just working models to give you an idea. The contrast between the Strauman uh, regular uh, solid abutments where the uh, margins are very subgingival as compared to capturing the soft tissue and being able to uh, to actually design the margin level where uh, you need it the, the best. And um, this is it, prefabricated. Uh, certainly uh, there are some things that we do to the model itself to help modify the situation, especially around central incisors. But it gives us uh, a fairly easy, user-friendly impression and something that has no tissue collapse whatsoever and saves valuable chair time. All right, again, another case just to show you. This was taken at the day of surgery, uh, very similar to this other case where we went ahead and then uh, took the final impression. So again, bone level at its, at its best, uh, easy to understand at this point, hopefully. Uh, if you have any questions about how we did these cases, um, many of these are immediate load cases. And so feel free to just, uh, just write in or call. I'd be happy to talk to you about the, uh, the technique. Okay, Dr. Jerry Cuomo again. Enjoy your holiday. Uh, it's getting a little chilly out there here in Florida. It's about, uh, uh, I think they recorded in the 40s at night, at least up in Orlando. Here in Boca, I think it's going to be around 60 today. You have a great day, and we'll see you guys uh, See you next time. Happy holidays.